tell me a little bit about this printer. Yeah, so this printer, it's a printer that prints makeup. It can take any image and instantly transform it into wearable color cosmetic. So basically it can uh, basically turn any phone, camera, or laptop into an endless beauty aisle. So imagine you're watching a beauty blogger showing you how to put on a eyeshadow and you see something you like, so you just pause the video and you take your color picker and you just pick the color. Move over to any software to print. Make sure you press, uh, you select the mink printer. What the printer is doing right now, it's um, it's taking the ink and it's it's gonna dye the substrate. So when it's done, you just uh, take it out. And that's the eyeshadow. Wow. How long does it generally take? Oh, less than less than a few seconds. What in particular, what's exciting about this? You know, it's finally training our girls to understand like the, the definition of beautiful should be in their control, not the corporations. If you go into a store and you're trying to look for a foundation shade or a powder shade and it doesn't match, you can't find anything that matches because there's like only seven colors, you know, you feel like kind of weird, right? That, that maybe there's something wrong with the way you look. Growing up, I felt that as well, coming from an ethnic background. The cover girls right now, they're, they're, they're Caucasian, they're black, and they're Latina. There are no Asian cover girls. There are no, no Indian cover girls or mixed race cover girls. And that's because of business, because those are the three biggest markets. It's just a very big societal issue that mm -hmm. I think the, the beauty industry just kind of needs to change in that kind of way. What would you say the price point is going to be for, for these printers and, and what kind of, you know, who are you really targeting here? Uh, the price point is, initially it's probably about like $300. It'll be a little more expensive than I'd like it to be because it's new, it's a new run. What kind of age group are you looking at? Oh, 13 to 21, just because, okay. you know, they haven't formed any habits yet. And I think, you know, we'll grow up with them and um, hopefully that's how, you know, we're going to change the beauty industry.